This is Jay with Organic Money. Shout out to my organic ones, man. Uh, this video today is about the Super Bowl. Super Bowl 55 is going to be the first ever cash the Super Bowl in history. All right? The NFL has really been showing the true colors as far as adapting to this new age of money, which is great on their end. Um, it, it, it's going to take place in Tampa, Florida today, and they're not going to allow any cash. So people that bring cash, they're going to have ATM set up to where you can have a $500 limit and, and you can put it in the, uh, the ATM and they give you a, a, a prepaid card. But you have a $500 limit. So they're doing that this year. They also have been showing the true colors as far as going catches with their new stadium. Like the, the Oakland Raiders who just became Las, Las Vegas Raiders have made a completely cashless stadium where no cash is being used. Not only that, this year they had their first ever player for the Panthers, Russell Oakland, actually getting half of his salary paid in uh, Bitcoin, which is the, the leading cryptocurrency in the world. And, and we've recently seen that Bitcoin just reached record highs of $41,900, you know, and it's making a lot of people a lot of money. So I think it's still time for people to invest and I think it's still a, a pretty good asset to go ahead and invest in to, you know, to where you can make some money off of it. So it's the reason, and right now we're kind of in a, a stage to where we're getting basic income, right? And the whole purpose of me talking about this cash in society is that it, it all plays a part on us. The more money put in circulation, the less it's worth. Right now, last year, 23% of all dollars in circulation was created last year. All right? Let me say that again. 23% of all dollars in circulation was created last year. That just goes to show you the massive amount of money print that we're doing. And this is, this is going to hinder us because the more dollars in circulation, the less it's worth. That's why it's, it's no coincidence that Bitcoin is going through. It's no, it's no coincidence that everybody is trying to shift from the dollar to another digital currency. It's because the dollar is dying, you know, and, that's, and this is more confirmation here with the NFL going to a cashless society. You know, like a lot, a lot also they, they make a lot of excuses because money is really dirty. Like 94% of money have bacteria on it, nasty bacteria up there. 77% 7 has dangerous pathogens in it. So they're using this opportunity to, to actually transfer it to a cashless society. Because the NFL had teamed up with Visa and they were going to roll this out a few years later. But what happened was the pandemic helped accelerate. So now we have today, which was, was going to be our first ever cash society, which is huge. You know, another thing is that a lot of people watch the NFL for their funny commercials. But this is another uh, red flag here where a lot of businesses aren't participating in their ads this year. Mind you, last year, they had a record highs of 100 million viewers, the highest for the whole year of watching the Super Bowl last year. So they charged about five to six million dollars for these ads. But this year, Kia is out. They're not doing the ad this year. Honda is out. They're not doing the ad this year. Budweiser is out. Budweiser said they're going to use the money that they would have did for the ad to help roll out and give more information about the vaccines. Um, Coca-Cola is doing bad this year. Their, their, their revenue is down 9%. Um, and they're cutting over 2,000 jobs. So they're not doing the ad this year. And then you have Pepsi. Pepsi is also not doing their ad this year. And Pepsi did team up with Beyond Meats. Okay? So Pepsi still, Pepsi's doing a halftime show, but they're not doing any commercials. And recently they just teamed up with Beyond Meats to come up with more alternatives for vegan and healthier uh, options for people that eat healthy. This just goes to show you What's going on? Like everybody, I told people, everybody has to adapt to veganism and plant-based diet because we are in the age of knowledge to where we where we're learning more. You know what I mean? We're questioning everything more, and stuff is gonna have is gonna have to make sense. If not, we're not gonna be we're not gonna deal with it basically. So this is huge, man. This is a huge turning point. Um, I just wanted to address how how big this year uh, will be with this cash in society, and and how how money is really changing. You know, it's no coincidence that, that Bitcoin hit record highs of 41, 41,000. You know what I mean? Just yesterday, it hit record highs again of 41,000. So it's not a coincidence because so much money is in circulation. You got universal income going on, and the more dollars put in circulation, the less it's worth. So people are running to different asset classes to help store their wealth and help make their money now while they still can. Because the dollar is going to be no longer in existence eventually. And we can see this happening. This is proof with the Super Bowl that they're transitioning from cash to a cashless society. You know, this dollar is, 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 is worthless. So basically what they're trying to do is, is change the game of money and switch to a digital currency. So I just wanted to uh, lay this information on y'all, man. This is Jay with Organic Money. 
I hope y'all adapting and I hope y'all uh, taking heed to what I'm saying in these videos, man. Like, comment, and share. It's J Warrior Money. Peace.